Hey everyone, we are going to try an experiment. And this experiment is dedicated to President's Day. Now, as you know, there's a certain president who promised not to tell a lie. And it has a lot to do with an apple. Do you know which president that is? I'll let you know in my descriptions, but probably some of you already know who that president is who promised not to tell a lie. All right, moving right along, the ingredients you need will be a Smirnoff green apple. Mmm. You will need Crown Royale apple. And guess what? Kool-Aid now has sour apple flavor Kool-Aid. You all, it tastes just like the Jolly Rancher sour apple. I'm not kidding. And by the way, this video is not for kids. However, if you leave some of these ingredients out, they could be kid friendly. But for today, this is not for kids. All right, you all, this is an experiment. So we're going to see how everything works. I've never done this before. So I just saw all these great ingredients. And I said, you know what? I'm going to try this out. So first, what I'd like to do is open this up. Pour this in. Now, depending on how many you're making for your friends, well, naturally, it's going to depend on how many bottles you're going to use. So, for now, I'm just going to try one because I've never done this before. Now, to add flavor to our Smirnoff. to put one spoonful of the Kool-Aid in here. Ooh, that's pretty. This smells so good already. It smells so good. Now you all, this Crown Royale is very strong. It has 30, what's that? 35% alcohol in it so depending on how much you want try that first we'll see about that we'll try that then what I did was I took some Kool-Aid and I mixed a little bit of water the Kool-Aid mixture and I froze it and then I used this to crunch it up so I, it's good. I froze it and I took it out a little while ago and I crunched it up. So now what we're going to do is take an apple. We're going to carve our apple. This is going to be our garnish. So let's take a piece. I think I'm going to just put a few pieces in there for garnish. Just a few. And look, I chilled a glass. I'll be right back. I chilled a glass and I thought it would be fun. Take some Kool-Aid, spoon a little of the Kool-Aid, put this over here, watch this you guys, in the top, I take some in the top, put some in here, and then so the rim sour apple taste. Mm -hmm. Look at there. It has it around the rim. This is going to be so good. 
So we have this here. Now I want to pour, oh, look at all this. I want to take some of this, take some of my mixture. I want a spoon. Some, I wish you all could smell this. Some of my friends on YouTube, I really hope you try this out. Please share this with your friends. I love sour apple and I love Granny Smith apples. So when I saw this at Walmart, I said, oh my goodness, I'm going to try and mix these ingredients together. So we have our apples. I'm going to put our apples in here like this. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. All right, now, I'm going to stir this up together. There we go. Stir this up together. Let's see how this is. You all, I wish you could smell this. Okay, you all know this is an experiment. Cheers. Cheers to you. Mm, look at the rim. Now let's see how it tastes. Ooh, that's delicious. Winner, winner. Well, my friends, looks like I have some finishing up to do. This is delicious. Mmm. Go on and make you some of this. I'm going to leave all of the ingredients below. Please like and share and leave some comments. I hope you enjoy it. Do you remember which president said that he would not tell a lie that relates to an apple? Happy President's Day. I hope you enjoy your day. Take care.